Yo, 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 it's your boy J Dizzle, aka JD, coming at you with a new hot Wi Fi battle for 2012, baby! Anyways, got a nice hot one for you today. Shouts out to Chowsu, you feel me? Uh, long drawn out, epic proportions, you feel me? Stay with the epic proportions. But, uh, yeah, this is a long one. And um, I hope you like it. He's going to lead off with that ratchet. And I'm going to lead off with that track rack. Because you know he's going to rack some shit. Rack him. Rack him. Anyways. So yeah. Uh, man. It's been tough. But uh, right here basically this is like a twofer battle. Twofer, twofer today. You feel me? You get a twofer. Anyway you get a park pass. <laughs> so uh, let's go ahead and get this battle started. I've been talking for too long. And uh, I really, I'm running out of stuff to talk about. <laughs> so, uh, this is against, um, damn, I just knew his name. Oh, well, I'll look it up later. Uh, anyways, this is against Noke E, um, I believe so. And uh, he leaves off with that ratchet. I'll just go for that CC just to get some damage off. It does a pitiful amount of damage to that Among Us. Because um, he just takes out like a fucking champ. And uh, right here, I'm going to go ahead and switch out just because... Uh, I wanted to make it seem like I'm scarfed or banded or whatever. He's going to go for that spore, and I really was trying to think of who was the best poke to go into to get a, to get hit by a status, and it was Skarmory. I mean, I know he's a wall and all, so I know he'll be able to live some shit. So he goes into that ratchet, and right here I just go for that EQ. Uh, not really predicting. He could have switched into that Tornadus thing, but I'm just going to go for the EQ because it's a safe play. Um, right here I really was thinking about should I go for EQ again I said oh well what the fuck I can't really do nothing to this Jellicent so I'm gonna just go for the EQ and I guess that was min max damage because the, the it didn't seem like the second one was gonna kill but it ended up killing so I mean hey kudos to me anyway he goes into Tyranitar and I'm really like what the fuck now <laughs> why would you do that I just take him out one shot uh, Memo is just fucking cleaning house right now now he goes into his own bull wreck uh, and I go for the EQ on his, and it does a fucking buttload, so if it was adamant, it would have killed him. Anyway, so he goes for his EQ. It's going to end up taking me out from this point, but my memo really wrecked his team. Uh, yeah, so, right here I go into Scar Force, which was really a misplay on my behalf, because I should have went into something that I knew that can take out the memo. I, I let him keep the memo. And... I don't know, like, I really, I, I don't know, I really was spazzing out this match, uh, I'm really not into it like how I used to be, so, you know, it's, I don't know, anyways, it goes into a, a, a fucking star scream, which can wreck my team with that heat wave, superpower U-turn, hurricane shenanigans, and, uh, right here I'm gonna switch out, predicting him to go for the, uh, for the heat wave, and I believe he was predicting me to switch out, so that was great play on his behalf, uh, he goes for the hurricane, ends up missing, Thank thankfully it missed, uh, the sand is up, so I would've took it better, uh, than normal, but, hey, whatever, right here I, uh, reveal that I'm not scarfed, I was bluffing, um, the whole match, I set up Stealth Rocks on the switch out, and, uh, well, I set up a sub, then Stealth Rocks. Now, right here, I'm going to switch out because I, um, I don't know. I, I know I can't take out a Jirachi with a close combat. So, I'm going to go into Scar Force. And this Scar Force is actually supposed to have, um, a Rocky Helmet. But I gave him leftovers because that's, like, the natural thing. But, uh, yeah, so I messed up there. Um, he switches back into Star Scream. I go into Task Force T because you feel me. We were up in that Task Force. Well, I'm not part of the Task Force because I'm not a part of Bitch Mob. I'm part of Gold House. You feel me? It's like it's two different. You feel me? You feel me? Portions of this of this base world. You feel me? I, I'm I'm on a positive side. Only when you know I'm, I feel like I'm about to catch a case. That's when I'm a rep Bitch Mob, and then I'll join the Task Force. But you feel me? See, I've been base since '09, so. You feel me? I can rap anything, you feel me? But anyways, y'all probably don't know what I'm talking about. Shofu gets it because he's black. Uh, he goes in Among Us, and 50 Force is just about to fucking let him have it with that fucking raw power, you bitch. You feel me? Yeah. Anyways, he go for that Giga Drain. It will take me out 
from this point. I thought I would be able to live thanks to Sandstorm and whatnot. But I don't think he has a Sandstorm. No, he does have a Sandstorm up. But he takes me out with a critical hit, which really mattered. But whatever. Uh, <laughs> Task Force T comes in and... I'm pretty much going to scare him out because he can fear either the hurricane or the uh, heat wave. Right here, he gets to have a death fodder. So, yeah, that's where it fucked me up. I should have just took out his mammo when I had the chance to instead of switching into fucking Scar. But uh, I have been playing stupid lately, and, well, this is makes it epic, I guess. Uh, right here, I go for the U-turn, which I should have just went for the heat wave. But, again, I'm I've been playing, like, kind of safe. So right here I go to copy force, which is that imposter ditto, you feel me, with that with that swag. Anyway, he go for that fire punch, predicting my switch out. So that was great on his behalf. I knew I should have just went for the fucking heat wave and took him out. Whatever, I go for the body slam, hoping for pair hacks. I end up getting it, thanks to the serene grace ditto hacks. And uh, he goes for the fire punch. I'm hoping he does not get a burn. He does not get it. This is my best chance to switch out into something that I know that can pretty much handle his ratchet. Because that's one ratchet ass bitch. And uh, I go on a drag force. Drag force is just a fucking drag queen king. You feel me? Because he's a fucking beast. So, <laughs> you feel me? Just plain and simple. He's a fucking beast. Anyway, I go for that rain dance. And uh, he goes for that beast slam. That beast slam does not get the parahack. So, I'm pretty, pretty happy on that. But uh, I go for that hydro pump. And I hit the first one. Okay, I hit the first one. Right here, I think he gets a Parahax. No. Right here, he body slams me once again. He doesn't get the Parahax. So I'm like, cool, I can take him out, and I can fucking wreck his team. Fucking missed the attack. Okay. So that's one miss. Drag Force. Hit that motherfucker with that Hydro Pump. I fucking miss again. Two times in a row. Hax gods are against me. Anyway, he's going to go ahead and go for that body slam. It ends up Parahaxing me, so... I go for the Hydro Pump now. Pretty much, I'm useless... Because I'm not fast. And uh end up taking out his Jirachit with a critical hit. Oh, thank you, Hex God. Thanks for the, the, the critical hit. It really mattered. Uh, the rain stops. And uh, in comes Starscream. He can just take me out with a U-turn or any move of his, of his liking. And uh, that's what he does. And thanks to Regenerator, he will be getting his HP back. So that's some fucking bunny shit. In comes Among Us. And my best to take my best um, bet to take out Among Us is actually um, my uh, Tornadus. But right here I'm going to copy Force just to hit the get the spore off. And now uh, his Among Us is sleep thanks to copy Force. Right here I'm going to end up switching out. Um, he was hoping that he'll end up waking up this turn, but he doesn't. Uh, Task Force T comes in. He's still sleeping. Um, if I can hit the fucking hurricane, I will take him out in one hit, but I fucking miss. He's still sleeping. And I go for the hurricane once again, and it will take him out. So, a uh, hurricane and a game just rhymed, and I'm fucking swagged up to the maximum, you bitch ass nigga. Anyway, so his Among Us is down, and now all he has is his. Is this thing called Thunderous? Or. What the fuck is this thing called? Okay, anyways, he goes into his flying bird magician genie thing, and he ends up going first, so he won the speed tie. If I would have won the speed tie, the fucking game would have been over right then and there. But, uh, hey, Hax is against me. So right here, I'm going to copy Force just to check and see whether or not he has Roost, and he doesn't have Roost, so I'm going to go ahead and switch out just to get some life orb damage. I go into Scarm Force. Scarm Force will be taking a hurricane like a fucking pimp, and, uh... Yeah, so I live it. I get some good uh, life orb damage. He's going down slightly. Uh, right here, he's going to go for that uh, that heat wave. He will be taking me out. And now it's going to be my Ditto versus his... Fuck, what is this thing called? Landorus, Thunderous. Wow, I really fucking like, I'm really like blanked. Anyway, I'm going to copy Force, and I go for that superpower. Yes, the superpower is the safest move because it's 100 accuracy. He said, why didn't I go for the heat wave? Because I was scared of missing, because the Hax guys are against me. As of late, he goes for the Hurricane. He will take me out. He will go down to his life orb, so that is a draw. We both end up with zero Pokemon, but he said he won, so hey, you won. Anyway, thanks guys for watching. Make sure you like and comment. <laughs> Peace. Later, guys.